you are headed out for a late summer getaway, there's a big chance uh, that a travel headache that's hitting our airways. Part of the problem is lost luggage. Consumer reporter John Mattery shows some steps you can take to avoid it so you don't waste your money. Celeste Small was looking forward to being a bridesmaid in a friend's beach wedding. But when her Allegiant flight touched down, her travel companion got her luggage, but she didn't. And I said, well, where's my bag? We checked them together. Inside her lost bag, her custom-made blue bridesmaid's gown. Celeste was devastated. She couldn't stand next to the bride at the wedding. Worse, she had to spend $400 on new clothing and makeup. Undergarments, another dress close to where she's not alone. The Department of Transportation says the 17 biggest airlines in the U.S. mishandled more than 215,000 bags in April, another 231,000 in May. Airlines are understaffed. They're, you know, they're losing bags left and right. Caroline Teal with SmarterTravel.com says to avoid the risk of lost luggage, fly with a carry-on only if possible. Now, if you need to check a bag, the key, she says, is not to put any valuables or anything that you need immediately upon landing into that check suitcase. Teal also suggests packing a tracking device, such as an Apple AirTag in your luggage and in some instances, travelers have been able to point out to the gate agent, hey, I see my bag, it's on the tarmac. Allegiant finally located Celeste's bag after the wedding. In a statement, a spokesperson said, we sincerely apologize for this inconvenience, adding that it's rare for Allegiant to mishandle a passenger's bag. That appears to be true. In May, Allegiant was best out of the 17 airlines when it came to lost luggage, mishandling one out of every 630 bags. Unfortunately for Celeste, her bag was the one. Here's my bag. I don't have my bag. Next time she's using a carry-on, that way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.